Hey guys, Steve here. So today I'm in an apartment unit, going to be installing about five vertical blinds, and it's empty, uh, which is great. Vacant units are always nice to install in. Uh, I just wanted to show you really quick, uh, you know, how the packaging comes, and as well as how a unit looks uh, when it's vacant and ready to install. So this is a great uh, video to show uh, installers as well as handymen on um, what a unit looks like to be able to come in and, and install quickly, uh, get you know five or six of these jobs done a day at least, maybe even 10. Um, so um, let me go ahead and I'll flip the camera around and then that way you guys can take a look at the unit and then I'll show you the packaging as well. Okay, so this is a unit in the Los Angeles area. We've got one wood framed window here in the living room. Okay, got some gray walls, some nice vinyl plank flooring. Okay, it's a dining room window, it's a small unit here. We've got kitchen. I set the vertical blinds box on top of the counter here. And then we have the kitchen window. Okay. And what do we got in the bathroom? Nothing, no windows. Then we have, it's a one bedroom, so we've got two windows in this little bedroom back here, so. Okay, so this is gonna be tough because I wasn't prepared to shoot any kind of videos today, as well as uh, I have to work, so I'm gonna do my best to shoot this video and show you guys, you know, um, what I gotta do. Slipping this around and then um, basically make sure when you unwrap you know, any of the packaging um, that you're not cutting across anything that's finished like a, the, the metal head rail or anything. So I'm just going to take the shrink wrap off of the box here. Okay. And first I'm just going to separate the, uh, I'm going to separate the head rails to each of the windows, pull out the hardware, separate everything to each window and then so that's easy to quick install. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and separate everything and then um, then we'll see you at the windows. So I open this box and the hardware's in here, screws and everything, so that's how it comes usually. You know, um, all the slats are in here, inside. Um, okay. So in any installation for blinds, you're always gonna need a hex bit, so. Um, you've got a hex, quarter inch hex driver uh, that you'll need and it's uh, it's great to have that kind of driver on your drill. So this is the, the type of driver. Let's see if it'll focus. Yeah, maybe it's not focusing, but you can kind of get the, right there, it's the better. So you can kind of see, you know, I got my DeWalt drill. So. Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm checking each of the, the sizes and, you know, checking which location they're at. See if you see locations there, product location, width, height, and all that other size. So this is how your order will come in as well. Whatever way you put the, the location, it'll have, wherever you have location, it'll have the, um, the location on there as well. So this one says KIT for kitchen. This is a DR1. I don't know why there's a one. It should be just dining room, DR and then LR for living room. So, and also just to confirm these vertical blinds that we're installing today, they are um, basic. I mean, there, there's no balance. It's no balance on them, um, low cost. I mean, this is a uh, low, you know, low cost rental unit. So it's something that uh, it's easy to, to install. It's a low cost product, uh, but yet it's easy to repair if it gets broken too. And wrap the paper off of the veins. Okay, so they come marked with the location, the size on there, and it's by, by each blind, so it's easy to separate. So it's convenient for uh, any maintenance guy, uh, any man, um, even a DIY person at home to be able to install their own vertical blinds, okay? Okay, so I, I propped up the, uh, the cell phone on the... Uh, top of this refrigerator so you guys can see in these 
how quick and how easy it is to install and get like this. It's empty. It's going to take me a little longer overall because I'm filming this, but other than that, it should be uh, pretty quick. I mean, we were able to prove uh, in another video that uh, we're able to install uh, vertical blinds in less than three minutes, at least one blind. So I've got a whole unit, um, you know, um, I'm going to guess maybe it'll take about 15 minutes. Uh, the clock right now on the um, stove over here says 12.51, so I'm going to get started. It's already been, um, make sure just turn to 12.52, so we'll say 1252 and then go from there and, and, and count 15 minutes. Okay, guys? Thanks. Let's get started. Make sure that all the clips are straight. That they're all lined up. And then um, when your your window has to go away that the window opens. So you see this window's stuck, but the window should slide that way. The screen's on this side, so it has to go in that way to the fixed side of the window. I didn't mention uh, on the other one, but the curve, when I have a wand like 
this. You want the curve to go like this, okay? Just so that way you can see the wand exposed and it'll close tighter. Uh, the wand won't be in the way. paper towels or something and, and well, if I'm down, if I don't have them like right now I don't have any towels on me they're in the van um, to make it easy I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wash my hands keep them wet and then we'll see what it does so I took my hands they're still a little wet shake them off okay and I just wipe them with my hands and basically what you're doing is you're taking away the dust and it's keeping electricity away from it. This is when, I, when, I, when I wipe them down, it's giving me PVC dust. Now PVC dust comes when you're cutting them, so um, they blow it off with the, with the compressor usually, but it's not always going to take it all off. So this had a little bit on it, I'm going to rinse it off again. And the sink here. Okay, I'm gonna go to the next one. I'm gonna do as many as I can so that way there's any electricity left over on any of them, even if they're not sticking. And it'll stop it from sticking with each other. Paper towel or two, two wet naps or oh, one handed. Let's see. Let's see how skilled I am. <laughs> hey, what's up? How's it going? Uh, I got interrupted by one of the, the maintenance workers who was um, taking care of this property, He's wondering who's in here, because I just kind of walked in and took, sort of started uh, um, working, and then I'm also talking, so he's like, who's talking over there? It's, in this. it's funny. All right, so I'm, I got a little uh, sidetracked there, but... Okay guys, so I am all finished here in this unit. Uh, I've installed these blinds and it took me, well, I went out and I had to go get the pair of tin snips. So it's 124 right now. So uh, I don't even remember what the original time was. So we'll add it on the video uh, later, just uh, mentioning how many minutes it took me. I'm gonna guess maybe 15, 20 minutes for the whole unit. So it's, it's a, a nice, uh, easy install to do uh, vertical blinds. So if you have interest or you've done vertical blinds before, um, this is a great uh, product to be able to uh, install um, on, on jobs. So, um, you know, let me go and show you the rest of the unit and see here. Okay, so here's the living room. 
the vertical blinds up here. Okay, and then the dining room, kitchen. It's a nice little kitchen. Okay, and the bedroom. Okay, now they're all open to keep the static down. Okay, but we have job completed and on to the next one. Okay guys, uh, take care. I really appreciate you watching our video. And uh, if you could please uh, click the like button, subscribe to our channel so you can see more how-to videos. And um, we have also product reviews, especially for maintenance and handyman uh, and DIY people who um, some really cool gadgets that will be coming out pretty soon. So uh, keep an eye out for that. And uh, we'll be doing product reviews. Okay. Uh, take care. God bless. And I hope you guys have a great uh, rest of your day. Thank you.